In the video for today, I'm going to give you two ideas through which you could use WhatsApp without an actual phone number or even having a SIM card. So the first method to sign up for WhatsApp without using a SIM or an actual number legally is to simply use a landline to verify an account with WhatsApp. So you could get hold of your phone, be it an Android phone or an Apple iPhone. This works for both type of devices. Get to Google Play or the Play Store and just do a search for WhatsApp out here. OK, so just type in WhatsApp and then install WhatsApp Messenger. Once it is installed, open the application, select your language out here and click on this green button. Now you need to select your country. So let me put in India, whatever country you are in, just put that in out here. After you do that, you see a country code pop up automatically out here to the left and to the right in the phone number part or the box, you need to put in a 10 digit number. All right. So if you have a zero in front of uh, your landline number or a couple of them, just remove a zero or all the zeros and put in the remaining digits out here. So let me put in my landline number and then click on next. Once you do that, you get a pop up like this asking you if this is the correct number. Click on yes. And then a code is sent to the number. Obviously, an SMS is not going to go to your landline because uh, it's a landline. You cannot receive an SMS out there mostly. So you click on OK. And then after one hour, what you have to do is click on didn't receive code. You get a pop up like this on how to verify going further. Here, since you cannot receive a new SMS, you could uh, go ahead and uh, select a voice call. All right. And click on continue. That is after this timer goes out or timer goes to zero after one hour. What is going to happen next is that you're going to get a call from WhatsApp and it's going to give you a code over the phone. So you need to like just keep a pen and paper handy, copy down the code and then verify your number by putting in the code out here. OK, put in the six digit code and uh, your account is going to get verified with the landline number. But if this doesn't work for you, what you could also do is verify a WhatsApp for business account. A WhatsApp for business account is similar to the normal WhatsApp messenger. The only difference is that a WhatsApp for business account is for mostly people having a business and wanting to manage the business through WhatsApp. That's it. OK, you could do ads and stuff like that. All those things. You could check it out yourself, but you could register for a WhatsApp for business account also using a landline. There it is definitely going to work if it is not working for you on the normal WhatsApp messenger. Same thing. You could just get to the Google Play Store or the App Store. Just type in WhatsApp business, install the application, open the application, click on agree and continue. Choose your country, put in your landline number out here without the zero or zeros. Click on next. It tries to verify your account, so click on yes. A code is trying to be sent, but it fails because it's not a mobile phone number. Obviously, you cannot receive an SMS in a landline number. Click on OK. And then after one hour, do the same thing as I've shown you previously how to do it on a normal WhatsApp messenger. Click on didn't receive code. Select voice call. Click on continue. This is after one hour. You're going to get a code via a phone call. Put in the code out here and get your account verified. The second idea to utilize WhatsApp without an actual SIM card or a phone number is by simply using a virtual phone number application. So if you go to Google Play, you could see that there are a lot of verified and good applications that allow you to send and receive text messages or even do calls online through their applications. You could utilize any one of these services out here like Second Line or Text Me or Text Now or whatever it is. And you could try getting a code. So you could just do a search for maybe text now. I think this is not available in my region, but uh, it should be in yours. If you're from the US or something, you could see that there are a lot of applications out here that cater to this service. You could try using any one of these applications and see which works for you. I hope you got some value out of my video for today. If you did, give my video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. Take care, my friend.